We are going to see some more projects like this one as money comes in to help Spokane fix its broken streets. The city will put a $5 million federal grant toward new street projects over the next two years. All part of the city's Fix It Fest. But maintenance has been happening all summer long, including on Garland. That's where our Drew Reeves is now with details on these new projects. Drew? This project here on Garland is almost complete, but Fix It Fest is far from over. Spokane has received a $5 million federal grant to help cover the $7 million price tag for the construction here. The remaining funds will come from the 2014 street levy. It's welcome news to neighbors who are excited to see repairs being made to their streets. Summer construction is a headache for drivers, but it also means brand new streets when all is said and done. Today, the city announced Ash and Maple Street as projects in the new two-year plan. Both were repaved around 10 years ago. They done Maple over there right after this one, and I can see a lot of the same issues on it as I do this one. Bob Lou lives on Ash. He says that work a decade ago hasn't lasted. Over the years, he says he's seen the street continue to deteriorate. I don't remember how many times they've come by and sealed the cracks on it, but you can see by the thing how it's separating it. The other projects include grinding a new overlay on Wellesley, Nevada, Mission and Sprague. These projects will be completed by a private sector contractors, so that means the work will be in addition to the maintenance projects our streets department already has planned. These projects expand on the 20 projects as part of this year's Fix It Fest, including small projects like crack sealing and pothole repair. The bulk of these projects has already been done, but we're committed to keeping the momentum going. Bob is glad that momentum includes his street. He hopes this time the street will last longer than the last time it was repaired. I'm going to be glad that they did it again because it is coming apart. Even though this means more construction and likely road closures outside his house, Bob says it's worth it. Yep, yeah, it'll be a new one. Yeah. I'll be glad. When these five projects are done in 2019, the city will have completed work on about 15 miles of Spokane streets. Reporting in Spokane, Drew Reeves, KXLY4 News.